Hello, I was trying to figure out how to take my space heater apart so I could clean it because it was getting really dirty. Um, I looked everywhere online, couldn't find anything. But it's a mainstay space heater. It's one of these little black or white square ones. So the face looks like when it's on. On these guys. They're pretty common now. It's pretty much the number one space heater at Walmart that you find or get, I should say. Um, so to open it, I'm just going to show you this real quick because I couldn't find anything online. On the back of your space heater, towards the top, there's a screw that's in this slot. It's a Phillips head screw. Here, let's grab it here real quick. It's this guy right here. So you unscrew this from that hole. It doesn't have to come all the way out, just make sure it's all the way unscrewed before you do this next step. And you'll take a flathead screwdriver, something flat that's pretty rigid that's not going to bend. And you'll fit it in the corner on the top and bottom all the way around. And you kind of just gently pry forward and it'll pop out. Careful doing this, you don't want to break your casing. By the way, before you start this, I should definitely say make sure it's unplugged. It'll pop out and you'll see these two clips at the bottom here. You can see them through the bottom when they're actually in the slot. The easiest way to take the bottom out is if you actually try to pry from right next to the clips. But you keep prying and then the face will actually pop out for you. There you go. Now you have access to everything in your heater. The best way to clean this is using rubbing alcohol so you don't damage anything. Be careful around the circuitry. If you need to take off your, your fan to actually clean your heating coil in the back, which is what I just did. There's a Phillips head screw right there on the top and right there on the bottom. You unscrew those and your little heating coil will actually lift out right here and you can access the back. Like I said again, just be super gentle taking apart. You don't want anything to break. These wires are pretty small so they're pretty easy to snap if you don't have much experience messing with the circuitry. And when you're taking it apart, make sure you take pictures so when you put it back together, you put it back together right. And then just to put the face back on, you just match it over the front, like so. We'll kind of encase that heater in. Make sure it's lined up, and then you'll just push it and snap it shut. All right, I hope this helps you. If you have any other questions, uh, pin some in the comments, and I'll do my best to reply to you as soon as I can. All right, well, hope this helps. Have a good night.